Hi Sagittarius, it's Tuesday. We're going to do your love reading. This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. It is general, as you know. Cannot, will not resonate for everyone. Just take what resonates and leave the rest. Roles can be reversed. They can intermingle, flip-flop around. It is not gender specific. So, if I say he, she, ignore me. Let's see what's going on for Sagittarius. Sagittarius, you've been showing up in other readings. Interesting. So, I don't know. Let's see. Seven of Cups. Are you playing the field? <laughs> I don't know what's going on here. Look at that options. That's a good place to be, actually. I have a lot of options. I don't know what to do. It could be confusion also. Why are we not focusing? There. Okay. So, okay, I'm gonna put that back. <clears throat> Your current energy. Love and blessings to all this touches. King of Swords. Um, maybe a lot of mental, not a lot of communication. That's not really like you. King of Swords is somebody who can let someone go if they don't, they're not beneficial to have around or if they're harmful. Um, five of Pentacles, that could be an Aries, I'm not an Aries, an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, five of Pentacles. The overall energy is feeling left out in the cold. Like, I can't believe this is happening. Um... There, there's an energy here of what's going on where, you know, it, it's just feeling totally like you've been discarded. So I don't know why, but that's the overall energy to a pentacle. Somebody's been juggling, it looks like. Well, it could be juggling a decision what to do. You may have cut somebody out for juggling. Oh, somebody's, somebody's cut out, it looks like. Aquarius energy here with the star. Dreaming, dreamy. Fantasizing is what I just got from that. Um, they may be fantasizing about you. The, the star energy is healing. It's more than that, I'm getting more, but I am feeling fantasizing. How they view the situation, they feel blocked or they're blocking you. A little bit not sure what to do, a stalemate could be. How they see moving forward. This person does not seem like they are on the up and up. I mean, I don't know. It looks like they messed up pretty bad. Hi, Callie. Can you all hear Callie saying hello? She's very chatty. She's chatty all the time. Let me see if she wants to come up here. Hi. Hi, baby. Get on my lap. Okay, no. Okay. Um, behind the scenes, Seven of Pentacles. What you cannot see, it looks like they're waiting. We're going to clarify that. They may be waiting for you to reach out. Ooh, Tarot's advice. I'm hearing family first. This is, you know, the whole dream, not settling. This is everything you've ever wanted, full wish fulfillment outcome. <laughs> somebody from your past, it looks like. It could be the same person, but definitely somebody from your past is thinking about you and is going to come in, come back. Um, but this is an energy, or I mean, it could be somebody, it's typically somebody from your past, but it's somebody that's thinking about you a lot, heavily. Um, bottom of the deck, six of wands. Wow, you're going to be recognized. Look how gorgeous that is. Beautiful. I need to put that in a thumbnail. That's beautiful. Six of wands, that is... Um, recognition, being recognized, being valued. Let's get some general clarification and we'll go from there. Um, <clears throat> Eight of Wands, communication.
location. It looks like maybe a whirlwind. There might have been a like a blow up. Um, some fierce communication. We've got that king of swords, you know, clear cut, not beaten around the bush. You know what I'm kind of thinking? I'm thinking that, that you may have been the one to feel left out in the cold, but I think that something's shifted. And they, I think they know they messed up. Ten of Swords, painful ending. I kind of feel, I, I've had a lot of arrogance in the readings lately, but I almost feel like, mm, I don't know, let me not say it yet. High Priestess. I think you are, that's a, you found something out. The High Priestess is somebody that knows. She's psychic. Wow, Two of Cups. I'm going to dig in a little bit deeper and see if this is new love. Because I think it's probably a combination for some of you. It's probably new love. Look at that. The emperor husband. That's pretty too. I love these the red in these decks. Do you guys like my new thumbnails? They're so I think they're so pretty. Or they're at least very fun. Some of them are pretty. Alright, so um tell me about this king of let's get a clarifier for the king of oh that card wants to come out. Um King of Swords. So, Hangman, Taurus, Virgo. Interesting. Maybe you got tired of that? I think they left you out in the cold and then in turn you're doing it to them now. You may not even know that's how they're feeling. Oh, whoa. And this, oh, I just bent this card. This, um, oh, the Magician. This, this juggling, this could be trying to um, balance out their feelings to what they want. Oh, look, right when I said that. So balance out. Yeah. I feel like this, look at this, look how they both are doing the same thing with their arms. Isn't tarot amazing? It's like right when that was on the tip of my tongue about to come through, or maybe the card came out first. I don't know, but it's kind of all together I'm trying to figure out this card, explore the different, what it also could mean and look at what comes out. It's just tarot just blows me away. I mean, what a blessing, you know. But anyway, so um, this this two of pentacles could be not. It doesn't have to be juggling you. Um, for a lot of you, I'm sure there was that. But it, this is, you know, trying to juggle. What am I gonna do? Am I gonna come? Am I gonna come? Am I gonna shape up or am I gonna ship out? Because <laughs> I don't think Sagittarius is going to what were you, they juggling maybe there was a three part third party i'm going to put this back because it is oh there's another three wow i was going to put it back because it 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 got bent which is why i pulled it three of swords and three cups that indicates a third party okay so for a lot of you that is the truth there's again i was about i was saying talking about maybe it what they were juggling and then you know i was saying well not maybe not and then the third two third party cars show up Oh, okay, so they're going to try and come back. Six of Pentacles, this is, you know, I'm so sorry, please forgive me. Um, but I don't know if you can trust it yet. Six of Pentacles, that's equal give and take. So I think they're going to come back around and um, they're going to say the right things. Maybe make a big to-do out of it, you know. Um put on a big production about it let's see what's the deal with they see you as the star how dreamy page of pentacles hmm. the page of pentacles is about you know communicating it, it could be a seed an idea it could be a apology actually and let me see one more I think they might come back and talk a big game strength card Leo energy and another beautiful card aren't these beautiful there's another tornado I guess it is Wizard of Oz I guess I guess it's not called Wizard of Oz okay so um moving on 
Moving on. Um, where are we? Two of Swords. The, um, how they view the situation is they feel blocked. So what are they going to do? They're going to spy. Look at that. Page of Swords. They're curious. They don't know what to do. Rules could be reversed. You could be blocked. You could be spying on them. But I did ask their how they view the situation. And we got Ten of Swords. They think it's over. I still, I think you turned the tables on them. Justice just showed up, bottom of the deck. Libra and energy. Um, that's things being made fair. Also, it's a very strong karma card. Let's look at the Seven of Swords. Wow, the Emperor again. So, um, hmm. Um, three of Cups. These just grab my attention. Nine of Swords. So, it this <laughs> Nine of Swords is about it not being over. This is almost an ending, but not quite. So, it looks like the third party thing may be not totally over. Um, I don't know why we have that Emperor. I mean, kind of high and mighty. Emperor usually has a real good vibe, but crossing the Seven of Swords, not so much. This one just tried to grab my attention, too. Wheel of Fortune. It's a timing thing. There's a lesson. There's another Karma card. And look what came up at the bottom again. Yeah, so there's a strong message. These cards are just not going to leave me alone until they show. They're spying on you. They're considering, I believe, an apology. They know they messed up. Um, either they're not totally out where they can, you know, free themselves or they don't want to. I don't feel like the, I don't feel like this is going to be totally on the up and up at that point. I think you do too. You know, you aren't okay with this and, um, you're not going to be okay with this. I don't think what you don't know is that they're waiting. What are they waiting for? Seven of Pentacles. Eight of Swords, feeling trapped, tied, bound. What are they waiting for? Oh, they might be stuck in something else. I just don't. I don't think that's the strongest energy here. I think that there's some. Um, I think there's an an ego thing. There's a need. See that? Yeah. There's a need. This person needs their ego fed. They maybe need more than attention from more than one person. Five of Swords. Oh, conflict. Look at this. Feeling regretful, sad. Why is there we go? Look at her crying, sad. Um, this is very conflicted. Um, regretful. What did I do? What am I going to do now? So what you can't see behind the scenes, they are being, they are trapped by that. I do feel an arrogance, but I still feel like they are sad and regretful they did this. But they're waiting for what? Three of Swords, bottom of the, oh gosh, bottom of the deck. Holy mo, oh my gosh, and another three. Look at that, all on the bottom of the deck. Three of Swords, three of Cups. Three of Pentacles, cooperation. What are they waiting for? I'm going to mix those in. Why do we have a Seven of Pentacles? Okay, Tarot, I'm serious now. <laughs> this just was at the bottom of the deck and I stopped. I didn't pull it. Okay, very strong message here. In fact, so strong that if I don't if I feel a pull towards a card and I don't go towards it or I don't pull it and read it, it's coming back. That's been happening throughout probably eight to ten times. I have had a card at the bottom of the deck or a card catch my eye and I didn't read it and it came out. So we have extremely strong reading here. They're waiting. Um, hmm. 
Gemini energy, six of pentacles. I think, you know what I think? I think they're waiting for you. Like they didn't think, they know they messed up, but maybe they were hoping that, that really doesn't make much sense. This doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. Um, they feel very fondly of you, obviously, but not enough this could be an ego thing. Not enough to stop, give up the other, whatever else they have, okay. No, tarot is telling you, if you choose to take it, Tarot's advice is to, um, Ten of Cups. I don't see Ten of Cups with this person. So either, you know, hold out for that, and this person either will come back. They're going to have to come back probably after a while, because I don't think you're going to take them back anytime soon. And it looks like there's a decision. Maybe they're ma waiting on you to make a decision. I don't know. I feel like they're waiting on you to come to them. Four of Swords. Yeah, resting, recovery, healing, not to be mad. I think you maybe had a blow up at them. There's that Three of Swords again. Ace of Pentacles, apology. Just be careful because I'm not sure and I don't think you are. I, I, you know, a half-assed apology is not going to work. Um, and you had the, the King of of sword so you already had an energy of enough no, you're low tolerance like I have no more tolerance for this king of cups is on the bottom of the deck um, tell me about this this ending the six of cups tell me about the six of cups what is that six of cups ten of wands Huh, long, heart, heavy. So something about this return or this person coming from the past, it's been a long journey. Somebody's coming towards you. Look at that, 10 of pentacles. You got 10 of pentacles and 10. Ten of pentacles and 10 of cups and six of cups. Yeah, I think this person might come back, but they may not be on the up and up. But you'll just have to, you know, see how that goes. Don't let them come back unless they, you know, um, are very legit and very sincere. If this is the same person coming back, it's they're not in that energy yet. It, this may be way down the road. This person knows they messed up. I just don't see them. doing much about it. Oh, give me one more, please. Or two more, or three more. Queen of Pentacles. That could be a wife, mother. Three of Pentacles. I think they're wanting you to, yeah, four of cups. Missed opportunity. They're wanting you to be okay with it. I don't think that they're, so I kind of like they're waiting it out to see how mad you are. I think it, it, I am, I'm just repeating myself now. Yeah, let's get a um, let's get a divine door. Let's get a divine door and see what they have to say. What door you're gonna walk through? Sagittarius, please. You know, Sagittarius. I, part of me can feel for some of you. There is a lot of love here. Um, there just may be an ego issue and and you know tarot is no judgment I hope you guys are learning that and there's no judgment because just because they're not doing the right thing for you to be with you right now you know is just because of where they are on their journey or their life experiences that doesn't mean it's okay it doesn't mean you have to be okay with it what all you can control is you and not tolerating it and in holding your value so that you end up in a better position than this with or without him okay Sagittarius what door intuition yeah see you know simple complex words of pain or words that heal you come to know the truth by the way that it feels you guys know trust your gut all right, let me know in the comments. I'm curious. I just want to read one more. It was at the bottom of the deck. 
Jude's song, a reminder for even the most hopeless of cases, you can find peace within the strangest of, strangest of places. I think that's within you. What? Come on. It's my candle, guys. I'm sorry. Sometimes my candle jacks with the camera focus. Um, I love you guys. Um, 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 let me know in the comments, and I will see you guys soon. Bye, Sagittarius. God bless.